Look at the sky, it's so blue. Right? And that's so rare to find here in Czech like that. What a beautiful day to go outside. Filipinas are preparing. <laughs> Tomatoes are growing. And sun is shining. Finally, it starts looking like a summer. Today is the 1st of May and with the month of May connects the tradition which is kept here in the Czech Republic. And in today's video, both of us with Gwen will explain you what's this tradition about. Hey! What are you sitting there? <laughs> Sunbathing? Are you? I am. <laughs> so, what will happen today? Today, I will show you something what you did not know yet. I will tell you that here in Czech, the Valentine in 14th of February is not the month of love. Here in Czech. In Czech we have different way how we celebrate the month of love. Yeah, Czechs are different. <laughs> so let's go. And something new for me today. I finally able to wear shorts outside the house for the first time. This year. No, this week. <laughs> this year. It's already warm. Yeah, Gwen finally feels like in the Philippines, the temperature today could be like 25 degrees. Look at the sky, it's so blue. Right? And that's so rare to find here in Czech like that, only during May and summer. Yeah, 14th of February, which is Valentine celebrated here in Czech. We celebrated the 1st of May, which is today. And with that connects two things which are done by Czech people. There at the back, you cannot see it now, but we will go closer. You can see a maypole. A maypole. I will explain in a moment. Right now, we are Looks slowly like approaching the maypole. <laughs> Gwen was mentioning it looks like a Christmas tree, but it's not. Should he climb in there? Try. No, you are not allowed. Why not? I will explain in a moment. So, what's that for? You know what's that for? No. The last day of April, boys from the village always go to the forest to cut the biggest tree they can. Then they will transfer it here to the village and make this maypole. The boys always build the maypole itself and the women girls are decorating the top of the maypole. So the women are climbing in there? Are women climbing in there? <laughs> I can, but I'm not sure if women here can. Yeah, I would rather decorate it <laughs> once it's still on the ground and then I would stand the maypole. Isn't it easier? No, it looks like a tree, like the whole tree. Oh yeah, yeah, I understand. Yeah? <laughs> Those colorful papers and stickers are made by women and the circle one the circle is the symbol for virginity in the village for women who are still virgin some villages which are even more traditious the boys who are in the relationship or in the marriage with women they will make this maypole in front of their girl's house so other men from other villages passing the village will know oh we, uh, we cannot date this girl because she is already in the relationship what? Like you have this kind of something in front of the house? Yeah, like in the past, maybe also nowadays, for example, I would make this maypole, but maybe just the smaller one in front of our house, so other men will know they are not allowed to approach you, because you are already taken. It brings the another thing. Boys from our village are trying to destroy and bring it to their village, their like the 
maple which is in the other village so for example me and the boys would just go to the other village we would cut their maple and carry it to our village why that's the sign like of the victory and in the same what? time <laughs> and in the same time the boys from our village must be protecting our maple from other boys from the other villages so too. where are the boys here why are they not here to protect the maple tree they are hiding <laughs> who knows maybe they are just hiding in the bush there the boys in our village are very protective Czechs are very traditional i would say very traditional yeah if filipinos are very traditional i would say Czechs are even more hmm. like in the past there were still like people wearing traditional costumes the women were dancing around the maypole and that's it but the traditions are slowly dying all around the world i would say and the another thing which is connected with the 1st of May is that every boy, every man who is in the who is dating or in the marriage with a girl should bring a girl little under girl? Hmm? little girl bring a girl under the cherry tree full of blossoms and kiss the girl under that cherry tree it will cause in the end that the girl is healthy and Young, Just forever. like what you did during Easter, that you pour <laughs> cold water on me so after that I got sick with middle ear infection. Because <laughs> you said it could be for women to be healthy. Yeah, the same for Easter mm. here in Czech. During Easter, the women are splashed with cold water and then beaten by the wooden stick. <laughs> so I got which sick. means in the end they will be healthy and, and was not young happy. forever. <laughs> I got sick. <laughs> and then <laughs> Gwen got sick. So, so it was opposite of my experience to be healthy but beautiful because it was not <laughs> it's not working for a filipino woman i would say <laughs> maybe because i'm not czech <laughs> no, in the philippines they have different traditions for easter yeah. i really don't want to talk about it and those of you who are interested in filipino easter tradition i'm warning you before you will start checking it it's quite cruel <laughs> But that's how it's celebrated in the Philippines. Right, so where's the cherry tree? Now, me as a man should find the cherry tree full of blossoms and... That's the challenge! Maybe Gwen will receive a kiss. But where's the cherry blossom? We have to find the cherry here. blossom. I'm a little bit thirsty. Thirsty? We are lucky. We are just sitting in front of the pub. So we will get some drinks and then I will try to find the cherry tree. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we're going now to the pub and Kuba's going to get something for me. Who's Kuba's dad? So get me some drink. Yeah. <laughs> I want this. Bubble. It's okay, it doesn't have to be full. It's, is it this, a beer? This is actually not non-alcoholic beer with the citrus flavor. Mm -hmm. I like it. Delicious. What is the typical look in the 1st of May? Wow. There would be so many blossoms on the trees all around in the Czech Republic but as you can see as, as you can see there is nothing because of the weather changes climate changes all around the world all the trees started getting blossoms already in the beginning of April all the blossoms fell down could be died dried out so Today there is there is a little chance that the man will really give a kiss to their woman under a cherry tree full of blossoms. 
there is a reason why there are no blossoms and not fruit anymore this year because of during the April ones there were all those blossoms came cold temperatures freezing temperatures and those blossoms were freeze it means there will be no fruits such as apples pears peaches apricots or cherry trees because all those fruits were frozen I will show you an example like this the cherry tree already started creating the fruits the cherry tree all of you know should be nice red fruits but because of it got frozen now it's like that and it's done for the for the whole year another fruit will be the next year <laughs> this cost the farmers and planters of fruits billions of money for example farmers who are having grapes growing grapes making wine had two bill had two billion lost this year they yes. will not produce anything and that's the crazy thing something is really happening with the earth nobody knows what some flowers were able to survive they started creating blossoms after those cold temperatures there is little bumblebee yeah, so working hard even if we are not under the cherry tree full of blossoms with Gwen let's just imagine there are those blossoms and yeah. have a kiss Sensor. <laughs> Filipinos will never kiss on the camera <laughs> done I finished my task for the 1st of May if we are right now in the Philippines Gwen would not be even holding my hand no, I will, but, but because no, of we are in Czech <laughs> there are no marites <laughs> who can back bite us and that's how it looks like the first of May how it's done traditions celebrating like those I believe it's different for the rest of the world who are still prioritizing Valentine's Day but as I said here in Czech we are different Ooh. How it's done in the Philippines is the Valentine's Day celebrated. Yep, give me flowers. Oh, yeah, all. I should give you a flower. <laughs> but uh, May in, Ch in Philippines. Here, my beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it smells amazing. I know. But May in Ch Philippines, we have a different celebration. It's a month of flowers for us. So we have this. Uh, Flores de Mayo celebration where girls are gonna wear princess clothing and they will parade in the road and they are being escorted by prince prince charming men mm, nice so, Flores de Mayo so they're bringing flowers so we will experience it for sure next year yeah little reminder don't forget to love your wives your girls your family all the time sometimes it's me who is lacking of those things as well right yes i know i'm right gwen will not admit it on the camera but that's all for this video thank you guys for watching if you like this video hit the like and subscribe but button button <laughs> button because gwen is always complaining i keep saying bottom <laughs> like my booty but it's not hit that button and see you in the next video take care always